My name is Jay Grams. My family has owned the Volo Auto Museum since 1960. We have a few hundred of the most exciting collector cars and they're all for sale in one location. I personally have handpicked them from around the country. Welcome to my sales shop. Come on, let's go for a spin. We've got a really extra special 57 Chevy Bel Air right here. Over a $150,000 body off frame, complete nut and bolt professional restoration. Here's literature and invoices. And the cool part about it, the guy that restored the car bought it from the original owner. Here's the original window sticker. Sold at s, &S Motors in Whitewater, Wisconsin. So this is a one owner car for the majority of its life up until recently, now a two owner car. But I'm telling you, the fit and finish, the quality of workmanship is excellent. This car was done right. Beautiful harbor blue, gray leather interior, power steering, power disc brakes, Chevy crate motor, overdrive automatic. Go to volocars.com. That's where you can read all the specs, study over 100 pictures top to bottom. And that is where you'll find prices on over 200 collector cars that we offer for sale. Go to volocars.com. If you enjoy watching the videos, subscribe to our YouTube channel. Click on that bell icon. That way you're notified as the new ones are posted. But the top is down. You know what that means. Let's go for a spin. Yeah, this thing's just really, really that nice. Uh, fit and finishes are excellent top to bottom. Underneath the car, it, it looks brand new down to the last nut and bolt. Uh, so they did take the body off the frame, took the chassis down to a bare frame, uh, you know, blasted it, painted it, uh, and then started putting it all back together with all new components, all the bushings, ball joints, springs, shocks, uh, all that's been replaced. Custom two-inch drop spindles in front, lowers it down a little bit. Uh, custom sway bar up front. And in back, the shocks, springs, bushings, all that's been redone as well. The exhaust is exceptionally nice. It's a two and a half inch, a nice fat exhaust system, and it's all neatly welded, and it's just bent very nicely. Someone really took their time in, in building this exhaust system. They, they were doing it uh, for a show car. They didn't just slap it under there. So anyway, it's all stainless steel, two and a half inch with MagnaFlow mufflers. You'll hear it at the end of this video. Uh, the entire fuel system was replaced. The tank, the sending unit, the straps, the lines. The brake system's been completely replaced. The hoses, the lines, the e-brake assembly, and it's upgraded in front to drilled and slotted disc brakes. Uh, the steering is CPP power steering. All the steering linkage under the front is new. You look up at the motor, it's still spotless, has a high torque starter. Uh, the transmission is a 200 R4, that's an overdrive automatic. Uh, it has braided stainless steel hoses that goes up to a transmission cooler. Uh, the drive shaft and new joints look new. It's a new Ford 9 inch rear end. Uh, so under the car is just all new. The floors are immaculate metal, 100% metal, zero rust, all painted like a satin finished black. Uh, so again, like, like brand new under the car. The body, the fit and finish is amazing. Uh, it's a harbor blue, beautiful color. It's an expensive German glazerite paint. Uh, the metal flake is laid out evenly. There's no cloudiness, no blotchiness, no color mismatches. The color is even all the way around. The clear coat is put on like glass. I feel like I could reach right in and grab the light bulbs, which are actually the reflection of our ceiling, but it is glass. The body is absolutely straight. I couldn't find a door ding, a dimple, a ripple, a blister. I couldn't find a crack. I didn't find a flaw. Doesn't mean I didn't miss something small, but no, this thing is absolutely straight. Fits beautifully. All of the exterior trim is either new or re, uh, restored properly. And I noticed the stainless, all the stainless trim is polished like chrome. This is not just stainless out of the box. 
This is polished like chrome. Uh, all the rockets, all of this up here is just sparkling. The, the lenses are new. Uh, the gaskets, everything up here is beautiful. The hood lines up real nicely. Uh, it's got dual mirrors, has the door handle guards. All new glass. You can tell here the vent window, it's all smoked glass, all new. Not stick on tint, but actual smoked glass. All of the gaskets, window seals, weather strips, it's all been replaced. The door jams are painted as nice as the car. New latches, sill plates, they fit beautifully. Has a nice custom made gray boot. It is actually a blue power convertible top. That whole thing is restored. The framework's painted, new weather strip, new top, new pads. Uh, and back here, all the chrome is done. Has optional reverse lights. Uh, I always got to point this out for those that don't remember, those that want to see it, there's a gas cap hidden behind the trim there. Uh, sitting on 15 inch chrome wheels, uh, the brand is Rev, R E V, uh, with Goodyear tires. The interior of this car is really nice. Uh, it has actual soft leather inserts, it's a tri color seating. The front seat has all new springs. Uh, it's all reupholstered. Door panels are custom made to match. There's leather in the middle, leather armrests. Now, under the hood is the GM crate motor. That's got to be the most trouble-free way to go is a, a GM crate motor. It's built by GM. comes with oil in it. You literally just put it in your car. Uh, it comes with a bow tie aluminum intake. This one has a Holly dual feed carb, MSD ignition system. It's got coated headers. Getting back inside here, it has the real nice tight loop carpet with bound edges, uh, gray uh, seat belts all the way around. They're retractable for the front. Uh, you have this center armrest cushion with cup holders sitting there. All the metal trim is repainted to match the interior. All the uh, aluminum and knobs, everything on the dash is replaced. Has a retro stereo that fits right in the hole. Uh, it has a hidden antenna. It has kick panel speakers. Uh, some really nice looking Dakota digital gauges, including the matching clock over here. The heater control panel is all replaced. It's a reproduction steering wheel, but it's a little bit smaller. You don't need that big steering wheel as long as you have power steering. So it's a little smaller, a little more comfortable. It has a leather wrapper. Uh, the steering column is actually new. Uh, it has cruise control with the mirror, the visors. It uh, has billet pedals, uh, all new wiring, auto wire, uh, wiring harness, trunk compartments all redone, uh, nice clean metal painted. Uh, it has the same matching carpet and it, it's got some foam insulation underneath it and it has bound edges. And underneath that and inside the car, the whole thing was lined uh, with Fat Man sound deadener on the floors of the car. Back in the motor compartment, uh, CPP power brake system with a dual reservoir, all new power steering, all new pulleys, alternator, uh, four core polished aluminum radiator with a polished overflow bottle, new horns, batteries bolted down properly, new battery cables, uh, it's got a real nice dipstick going down to the transmission, and everything in here is painted beautifully. And again, all new wiring harness front to back on this car. Uh, the heater core was replaced. It's got a nice fan shroud. Uh, back in the trunk here, new well liner, new weather strip. Uh, it's got a tire that's never been used on a blue painted rim. It's got the jack assembly. And it's real slick. The latches look new.
So this is a really exceptional car. Again, keep talking about fit and finishes. It's beautiful to look at. Always a fan of Harbor Blue. It's got a pretty neat story being a one owner car all those years. Professionally restored. You can't go wrong with this one right here. It's one of the nicest there are. How nice that shuts. But that's my impression of this car. Go to volocars.com. Plenty of ways to reach out to the salesman. If you have specific questions or concerns, make sure you ask them. They'll help you the best they can. They can also help get this delivered to your driveway and help with financing. That's at volocars.com. If you enjoy watching the video, subscribe to our YouTube channel. Click on the bell icon. You'll be the first to see the next one that we post. Thanks for watching.